Hey, hey, what's happening guys? My name's Mailbox and I have another Black Ops 3 Zombies video for you today discussing the brand new Zombies ranking system uh, that we've heard a little bit about. Now, I'm going to share with you guys everything that we know uh, that's official about the ranking system and then I'm going to kind of stem off of that with some speculation and some ideas. Uh, hopefully this stuff is getting you hyped up for November. Um, I have a broken wrist right now actually, so I can't play any Zombies, uh, but I'm trying my best to provide this information and these videos and just to get back in into this. I mean, I miss zombies, man, and I really appreciate all of you guys' support. So, if you enjoyed the video today, and if you have the time, I could not thank you enough for smacking that like button in the face. But enough of that. First things first, we're gonna head over to the Call of Duty Instagram where they uploaded the uh, short video of the zombies teaser that we've already seen at the uh, end of the Black Ops 3 uh, reveal trailer, but the caption is what's interesting. Uh, we have zombies confirmed, four player experience with a unique storyline, and an XP progression system. So, that's where we get the information uh, that the Black Ops 3 ranking system isn't going to be like the Black Ops 2 one. Uh, we all know that the Black Ops 2 ranking system was all over the place, very confusing, very unclear, uh, primarily included just so that players could get a general idea of their teammates' skill level, uh, but this time we have an XP progression system, uh, which makes it sound like it's going to be much easier to understand. I think it's going to make a lot more sense. Now, I'm going to play just a short snippet of an interview with Mark Lamia, Treyarch Studio Head, where he only briefly mentioned the ranking system, but turn this shit up. Listen closely uh, because there's some things that may not have grabbed your attention before, uh, but the things that you need to hear. So here we go. And all that stuff is there, but but we do have a player progression um, system in it, which I'm not going to get into. But that's kind of cool because it really rewards your investment as a zombies player as you rank up, right? I think right. there's that there's that recognition. Um, uh, not just in the leaderboards, but but having that having that rank as you go through it. All right. So since Treyarch isn't ready to give us clear, direct information just yet, it's our job to literally dig into what they're saying and just listen very closely. Uh, first of all, he specifically says as we rank up, uh, which gives me the idea that there will be specific zombie levels, zombie ranks that we can get uh, when we reach a certain number of XP. Uh, Mr. Dalek JD in one of his videos was also very kind enough to share uh, that the people at Treyarch Arc mentioned that each mode is inspired per se uh, by other modes and that the zombies ranking system is a tad bit inspired by the multiplayer ranking system and we all know how that works I mean I never play multiplayer but the ranking system uh, involves XP uh, unlocks levels prestigious it's very familiar uh, Lamia also mentions leaderboards in the interview uh, you know we're gonna be getting recognized in the leaderboard so that's just something to hold on to uh, now what probably stood out the most to me is when he said that we're gonna be rewarded for our investment in zombies and for some reason, I don't think that he just means, oh, you're going to have a better emblem, uh, you'll have a cooler image next to your name, because to be completely honest, that's not very rewarding. Um, it's cool looking, sure, but it's not all that significant. Uh, what if, and now of course we are getting to the speculation part, uh, we're rewarded with certain unlocks and certain privileges as we gain more XP. Uh, these could come in the form of starting weapons, maybe as you level up you get improved pistols to start out with, uh, maybe points, maybe we'll get additional starting points, uh, special weapons in the mystery box, but we don't want to go too far, you know. Uh, we don't want zombies to turn into a game mode that is dominated by the ranking system um, of course, and I don't think that it is going to turn into that. Uh, Treyarch has made it very clear that they don't want to mess with the simplicity of zombies. It's not going to interfere with the good old zombies experience, you know, but I, I do think that we're going to get certain rewards and certain unlocks. Uh, we also know that in terms of multiplayer, Black Ops 3 is going to offer new customization capabilities. Uh, we've all heard about the custom gun camos, so maybe as we level up in zombies, uh, we too will get more opportunities to customize our experience. Uh, maybe not the gameplay experience experience so much. We don't want to mess with the storyline or the dynamics of the game, uh, but more things like maybe gun camos, grenade types, uh, maybe character type stuff. Uh, I don't know, stuff like that. Uh, but what about you guys? What do you think should be incorporated into this new system? Uh, remember that Treyarch is still looking for ideas from the community. Uh, they are strong listeners because they want to make every improvement to the game possible uh, while they still can, so leave a comment. Uh, what rewards should we get? How many levels should there be? Stuff like that. Um, I'm pretty dang excited for this. I mean, I'm just thinking about it and I'm imagining, you know, like uh, playing a game, dying on round 15 or whatever, and instead of just telling us uh, how many kills and headshots we got, um, the game's gonna tell us how much XP we earned, uh, what zombie level we are, maybe what we unlocked, I don't know. Guess we just have to wait and find out. 
Uh, but check out some of my other Black Ops 3 zombie videos. I will have every single bit of zombies information on this channel when it gets released, so subscribe. Uh, follow me on Twitter, do your thing, click all those buttons. But thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Uh, I will see you guys next time. It's been Lonely Mailbox.